day dear chess lovers and welcome to another Chess in the Wilderness episode. Today I am hiking near high altitude lake Nazelli. Uh, I even spent the night in here, put a tent near the lake and spent a wonderful night under a starry sky. Since I knew that the view is going to be majestic, I took my chess set with me in order I can also share with you a chess puzzle and you can also enjoy the view. The following chess puzzle was composed by Hungarian electrical engineer and chess composer Otto Blatli, first published in 1936. The task is to win with the white pieces. You can pause the video and try to find the solution. Earlier I have already published many chess puzzles and problems by Blatli, who as you know was specialized in grotesque theme. So this one is also grotesque, we have a position which is very difficult to reach in a real game. Yeah, theoretically possible, but yeah, uh, highly difficult to reach. And uh, we can see that right now white is a queen down, but relying on the power of the pawn on g7, white will now win the game. Also this king and the knight are awkwardly placed, and so now white will uh, win the game. This is how it goes in grotesque chess puzzles, usually the winning side uh, is materially down. First white is playing bishop c3 and is waiting, making actually a waiting move. White needs to corner this black uh, queen. Uh, at the same time white is covering the, uh, the a1 square. So this is the start of a triangulation technique. Queen g2 Black is now threatening queen a2 check, which can lead to a checkmate, and we are playing uh, bishop d2, covering the first rank, uh, second rank, sorry. Queen goes on g1, renewing the threat, and bishop e1. So now we reached the initial position, but now it's black to move. With the help of a triangulation, white lost a tempo, and now it's black to move. Black is playing queen g2, and with queen uh, bishop f2, we are cornering the queen, thus putting black in a position of Tsuk Black queen can't leave the g file because in that case we can go for a pawn promotion. Uh, all black can do is to make a move with his king and we are making a move with our king as well. We are gradually making a progress, king d8, king b7, king goes on e8 and since now our king is no longer on the a file, there are no more checks, we can start blocking the g file. Bishop h4, uh, bishop g5 is coming in order to make use of our g pawn. King goes on d8, bishop g5, and now there is nothing which can stop our pawn. Queen goes on e2, and so a new queen is appearing on the board. Check, king, uh, queen goes on e8, let's make a waiting move. Queen g7, black is making a random move, we are winning this pawn as well. If queen e8 for example, then queen d5 check, followed by a checkmate, and this is how white is managing to win. A very very nice chess puzzle, hope that you enjoyed it. Uh, white was a uh, queen down, but with the help of a conning technique, conning strategy, managed to win. Feel free to share this puzzle with your friends as well, and in the end, let me sharpen your technique tactical skills. It's wise to move and win the game. We'll wait for your answer in the comment section. Thanks for watching, we'll see you in my next video. Take care.